Hello, this is Rebecca here, and today I'm back with another snail mail idea. I have created um, these small kits that make great gifts, or if you know a person that's your pen pal, you could put together one of these little kits and send this to them. Um, or these are also great little gifts for um, maybe someone that loves to send mail or create. And um, so I just kind of wanted to show you um, what I put in my little snail mail kits. Um, I do want to ask that you forgive the raspy, crackly, squeaky voice. I have been sick for over a week and um, coughing and chest congestion. So my voice is kind of still getting back to normal, but feeling better. So I am very, very thankful for that. But um, let me go ahead and start with this happy mail snail mail kit and um, I'll show you what I put in there. Now um, I created these little tags from um, <clears throat> they're actually part of a paper kit kinda like this they came in like a, a little uh, six by six paper pack and these were just some that you know how you've seen those if you're a paper crafter they come with several different designs and I, I just cut them um, I just cut this from one of, I think they were punch outs actually, and this is the, this is the one, uh, Kaiser Craft, but um, you could just actually punch them from the back, and I just use those as the tags for actually for both of these. But in this little kit, <clears throat> I geared it very, actually towards a lot of pinks and hearts and things like that, and I'm just going to set out what I have in the kit. These are actually little punches that um, you'll see that I've punched out some hearts and these were just from that punch that I left, um, that those were left behind. These, these are very creative, never waste paper. I've got a pin. I've got some sparkly glittery goodness. I've got little bitty heart stickers. These are um, just little bitty stickers that you can take off and put on an envelope. I've got red and colorful ones. Here's another one of those little cutouts. I've got a washi tag sample and what this is is taking a blank white tag and I laminated it and then I added different colors of washi and usually I put about 10 rounds of washi uh, 10 times circling around. And then I included a little uh, flower. This, this just came in a kit that had a bunch of little um, flowers in them and so I'll just kind of put that in there for decorated purposes. <clears throat> some ribbon uh, put together with some twine and then inside these little envelopes here I just cover, I sealed with washi are the actual hearts that I was talking about that I used my punch and I just punched these out and that way these can be used for glue or they can actually um, be sent to someone else with little messages or um, you know actually just kind of you could even put this in inside your snail mail card and send that out with with um, with goodness in there put some heart maybe put some heart goodness on the outside um, and then these are little tags that um, also came part of a kit that I had the these are part of the um, snap um, packets I purchased a lot of these because they have just a lot of fun little cards that are different sizes um, made for the scrapbooking, the snap scrapbooking. And then these are just some plain um, cardstock. And then I include two cards that are um, my design, but um, and but I'll show you what I'm planning on doing with these. And then here is some um, additional cardstock. Some of it is. Um, double-sided and some is not. So what my intention is, my thought process, I think there's six sheets in each kit, my, and then of course the white envelopes, and, and these are just these uh, envelope um, stationary holders, but let me show you what my intention is. So you take your card <clears throat> and you cr can create one of these the fold-out cards, so you can even use your washi to um, put this piece on here, make it a fold, and then you can make it a fold out, or you can fold down, and then you can use these to decorate the inside um, of the cards like that, or you can even cut these up and use them for something else. So that's what my 
idea is behind adding the different um, types of uh, papers, different colors and designs, and kind of coordinate with the actual cards. And these you can use your own cards, you could put blank cards in there, um, just something so that they can create. And then I just kind of put this back in here like this, kind of to keep, um, so it's kind of different. When I ship them out, I like to make sure that they are, um, you know, you can see all the different fun pieces in there. Like it's a little treasure being sent to you. So that is the first little kit. The I call this the Happy Mail Snail Mail Kit. And then let me show you the Rainy Day um, Snail Mail Kit. And this is one of my favorite kits to put together. And inside here is, let me show you. These are, um, inside here, these, these actually are some little cellophane packets that I bought off Etsy from um, Magical Moments. I will put a link to her um, website. She has all different kind of cellophane bags for really inexpensive. And she is one of the most um, thoughtful, thorough Etsy buyers I have ever. She keeps you on track. She tracks your, pro your shipment for you. And it is shipped almost that day, if not the next day. And she's super nice. So um, I do buy a lot of her little um, cellophane bags. And this is one of them. And you can just put your little, um, these are the little fuzz balls. Um, and I've seen these used, it might have been in the snail mail book, but they're just little, um, these cute little fuzz balls that you can glue onto envelopes or onto the inside of the card. They're just happy. I think they're just little happy things. Um, so I have a, a set pack of those. I've got some more sparkly glitter goodness. This is also um, using one of those cellophane bags. Um, this is a this is a ribbon, a bald ribbon that I just um, tied together with some yarn. And here's another one of those um, punches that I had punched the umbrellas out, but I included this in there. And these are little paper flowers that um, I, you can buy. Um, I buy mine at Hobby Lobby. Um, but they're just little um, paper flowers. They come in a pack of all different. Uh, usually they're kind of color coordinated. Um, but just then they have a gem on the outside. So I put those in there because, you know, rainy days brings flowers eventually. <laughs> and then inside this little envelope pack. Let's see if I can open it up here. Is using my cloud punch and my umbrella punch I created these little all these different little clouds and now I got a little carried away with the clouds because of course I love clouds but um, you could I mean it's just fun these are to me it's just um, these are happy little things so anyway so this is just full of clouds and um, umbrella punches and you, you know, that's the fun thing about these little kits is if you have punches, you can just pretty much put almost um, anything, um, anything in here. I mean, you could put hearts. I mean, like you saw in the other one, hearts. You could put snowflakes. I have, um, you could even just put round shapes, different color shapes in there, stars. Um, so that's kind of a fun little thing um, to have included in here. And they can be used... Um, throughout the cards or like I said um, as a giveaway inside one of your cards um, and then um, I included washi sample here which is some of my favorite washies because it has clouds and little raindrops and umbrellas and then um, this came in a kit I can't remember who it was by I almost want to say it's um, let me think. It was like a garden. It was a garden, or um, it was another kit I had. But I found this in one of my boxes, so I said, "Oh, that's fine. That's you're my sunshine. You can include words in there. Um, umbrella, clouds. Here comes the sun. These are all part of the um, kits that you can buy. Um, the snap um, journaling kits for 
<coughs> for the actual scrapbooking, for the snap scrapbooking. And then um, your sunny days and your clouds. And then some cardstock, a blue pen. Um, these are some fun little stickers um, that have clouds on them. And then I have my two cards um, with umbrellas. My umbrella girls. And then um, these are, again, some coordinating uh, card stock that I thought could be used along with um, with those cards. So that sums up the rainy day kit. And um, again, using putting these kits together are these are just so much fun for me because I think not only would I enjoy receiving one of these and going through it and putting cards together and snail mail, but um, so I, I always think that others would do the same as well. But I appreciate you for joining me today, and I hope you're inspired to put together a little kit and um, send it to someone special. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in my next video.